We've only seen that in Oceania, uh, Oceanic region and uh, a couple of places elsewhere, not very often. Going to be the last pickup of Cassiopeia coming in for Febman, something we saw yesterday from Nine. I think that we just had a Mountain Dragon game that it didn't get taken for like 16, 17 minutes, so... Oh, Yellow Star, got to be careful! Did not want to step into that bush. Max Thor is going to chase after him. He's got the full damage coming in from Huston and Sonstar as well. Long range support out from Reckless, but it's not going to be enough. Sonstar is going to come in with first blood. Yeah, it goes over to Sonstar, and I like the path from Max Law here. Early birthday get some extra basis onto that MVP award from this game so you can be player of the game. Uh, Yellowstar maybe getting caught a second time would hinder that. Um, yep. But uh, all the CC in Ooh, the world. Smash out from Noah. Oh, he did not want to be there right now. Max Law will take down the birthday boy. That's another kill over two giants. And Yellowstar will dodge the final javelin. Uh, Spiritual Soul uh, Spirit? of his health through a javelin. Uh, and now he's just trying to get out of here alive. Javelin doesn't land the second one at least. Knight's following after. Look at the damage from the Chaos Storm. And Spirit's gonna die again to Maxlaw. This is going even more worrying. Yellowstar getting caught again, but he's fine for now. I'm not sure uh, about that, He though. has the flash. Uh, oh, but the javelin from Maxlaw take down, flash away. I was going to say, he had Reckless and Feberman over in the middle lane who would surely come across, but they yeah. believe him. Ash does have Ghost, so it's not really going to be the uh, the end of Feberman unless he really misplays fairly hard. But Maxlaw's coming in from the side here. It's a big group. Feberman is just locked in place, and after the first bit of CC landed, he was not going anywhere. The decision to go in group. This may be, I don't want to say an overstep, because well, look at the vision dying. Oh, it's dying very quickly, and Fnatic can't actually go through their own jungle to defend. So this is a great readout by Giants. Fnatic can't get there in time. That's a Baron going over to Giants. And I don't know, Gamsu or Spirit. Yeah, Spirit will find Max Thor, maybe the other way around. I can't tell just yet as Reckless comes in. He's going to open up with Curtain Call. Hudson is under fire, but Max is going to fall first. Maybe the turning point for Fnatic. No perfect game for you guys right now. And Febvin with a follow-up, but great ultimate by Sunstar. Will save the support's life. Big ultimate coming in from Victor. Will detonate Febvin. Might be in caught in place now as he is behind the team. But Gamsu simply doesn't have the damage. Will be zapped down by Knight. 2 on one the same time, though. This is a dangerous spot for Giant. Giants rushing this down. Gamsu, he's very close. He doesn't have flash though. He's gonna have to hop in. It will be a one-way trip if this goes south. Spirit's dead already. He can't get the smite down. And it will be Maxwell securing the Baron. Gamsu jumped in. Pops the ultimate, but he's dead before the animation finishes. Yellowstar is gonna have to flash away. Feverman will put down the defensive ult as cover fire to try and save his Nami. Maxwell got a little too deep and he'll pay for that for his life, but RC Giants not gonna be too out too. But uh, Gamsu and Reckless gonna go for this two versus one against Smitty. Gonna Going into Zonians, but Yalastar coming in as the cavalry Gamsu into the ultimate, the wall of the CC chain. But there's a guardian angel as well, and Smitty, he just refuses to die. Spirit's gonna come up, rest of Giants are gonna come out, but unfortunately, not able to save private Smitty J on this one. Giants are looking to back away, but double bubble out from Yalastar opening up with the ultimate. Last one's gonna land onto Max or Spirit backs away with Gamsu, but a lot of these Fnatic members are low. Giants are in fighting shape. They might still be up. Knight looking to close in around this triple man stack. Knight, he doesn't have the ultimate anymore, and the Glacial Fish will again split up the fight. Fevman will drop. Yeah, Stark goes down. Knight looking for a third onto Reckless. He'll find it with the Q. Double kill to Knight. And Fnatic are collapsing. They're collapsing and giants. So uh, <laughs> I'm pretty really sure. Work out. I'm pretty sure there's only went, meant to be one short straw, uh, the, the not three. five. Yeah. Uh, Yellow Star. Ooh. Oh. He's dead. Yeah, he's dead. 700 damage is uh, gonna secure his death. Gamsu is gonna try and help Spirit out, but his whole team is just dropping left and right. Giants are gonna find the game here. There's literally nothing that Fnatic can do. And those Giants with five men strong move on to the next itself in 36 minutes. Absolute demolition over Fnatic. Just looking at Knight's face there, he did the pop jump. He was incredibly happy with how that game went. You see so often after these first games, people are just like, subdued faces, like, ah, that went all right. But facilitating Sunstar, final pickup of Victor will go to Knight. Um, had a pretty good game last game. I actually liked creative ways he was finding to look for flanks and land a really big ultimate. Yeah, that one. Spirit is waiting in the jungle, though. Maxlaw may become the hunted in this game here, Stress. Oh, that's the under show. Maxwell is low. He's gonna go underneath, get the knock up, and now oh, Red Spirit. Press also chiming in. Maxwell jumped out the spirit. He gets the walk 
31 kill against Spirit. Max Law, first blood. Yellowstar coming in here, throwing the axe. He's just like, okay, well, if you're going to be there while, while uh, you know, Red Buff's still attacking. Yeah. Oh, hang uh, on, mid lane, Fenelon, so bit. low. He's so low and he's so far pushed up. Max Law, easiest gank of the century right there. Comes in, gets the knockup, gets the kill. Two and zero, Max Lane. Not currently warded from Fnatic. Yellowstar's no flash, remember? No flash, but he's near full health. Sunstar's gonna come forward with the fourth shot. Max Law instantly exhausted. Doesn't have flash, remember, but Reckless oh, the chain. still be under attack. See, see. Double knockup anyway. Bubble land, Sunstar gets the fourth shot and the kill. 3-0, Giants. Slow down, Gamsu. Wait, hang on, dual lane's bot lane here. Gamsu goes aggressive. And Smitty, he jumps onto Smitty J. He'll get the NAR ultimate down, but Sunstar and Hustle are easily able to pick up the kill. Gamsu for the duel. Gonna take the top tower here. Will that be trading the bomb tower? Well, Smitty J is there, and he might be able to defend. Tempered Fate's gonna CC the tower for now. Here comes Spirit. Smitty J shouldn't be able to get out here alive. Flashes over the tower, but has been exhausted. Finally, Spirit will take him out. Magical Journey will save the life of Yellowstar. He really here. It's gotta be from a Tempered Fate. Fevin, as soon as he comes in, gets immediately bubbled, but Gamsu is also on top of there looking for the TP. Hustling is not gonna go anywhere. Who wants to pick up the kill? It's gonna be Reckless. And Fnatic do find a kill in return. Giants. Maybe not, because Maxwell's gonna find him in the mid lane. Tidal Wave will land onto Yellowstar, and Maxwell's still following after the Queen's Wrap, but he'll be locked in place. Fevin coming in, Maxwell survived, so does Yellowstar. And meanwhile, on the top side, Gamsu and Spirit aggressing onto Smitty J. But the bird just simply won't die. He's gonna go down eventually. It's gonna take a long time to do it. Finally, we'll get him. And Reckless is under fire as well. Hudson and Maxwell will come in for the kill alongside Knight. So that was a one for one trade across the map. Yeah, to uh, Siege in here. However, Maxwell is looking for a kill onto Yalistar. He'll be taking the magical journey. So will Reckless. But Knight's there to greet them. Ultimate Ooh. comes in. And the long range ultimate from Sunstar will be locking down Yellowstar. Uh, the laser and the ultimate from Knight will eventually finish him off. Spirit's gonna have to back away, so will Reckless and Febbervin. Picked off by Sunstar, we heard Veritas talking about it, how easily you can burst people down. Uh-oh, Febbervin probably should have stepped forward there, right into a bulb from Hudson. Another lockdown, another kill. Giants will be happy to pick up that kill and the middle lane tower. Another Getting caught. Hop, hop, and uh, get out of the bubble. Spirit's there to help him, but uh, this is all going to fizzle out. Yellowstar's coming in. There's a man called Journey looking to cut off Maxlaw. Needs a Cosmic Binding. Austin's going to have to flash away. Spirit's chasing after as well. Knight's going to come into this one, and the TPs will rain down. And Yasansar is getting these long range artillery shots down onto Ooh. 800 damage crit. Onto Spirit will finish him off. Double kill out for Sansar there. And Giants will be locked in. Where he's really going. Yeah, Smitty. Oh, they're gonna go Baron at the same time. Look, direct side oh, up towards the top side of the map. Fnatic but way over committed bottom side. He just needs to buy time. It's fine that he dies here, and Giants are immediately onto this Baron. Uh, I don't even think Fnatic can remotely contest, and they're sending three members up the river. They're just gonna go back and farm. <laughs> I mean, Fnatic, oh, uh, I mean, the play was somewhat right if you only commit a handful of people to that yeah, play. Not five. If you commit maybe two or three maximum people if you've got teleport users there, you can actually expecting to at least pick up a point from this series. Yeah. Uh, but Giants are about to shut them out. Here's the engage here from Fnatic, trying to make something happen, Spirit's but Spirit dead. runs in and instantly dies. Gamsu is in from behind, but they don't even want this fight anymore. Fedman's getting eaten down by it. That's the game. The long range damage in from Sodstar. Triple kill for Giants. Double kill for Knight. Giants, 26 minutes in, are actually looking to finish the game. Yellowstar and Gamsu can't defend. What is even going on? Gamsu, he's back into mini form, and there's five men there from Giants who are all basically full health. The second Nexus turret dying. I can't even believe my eyes. Giants are gonna take the two and zero over Fnatic this week. An insane performance out from Giants. Really have to commend some of their early game plays against Fnatic here punishing Fnatic's early game weaknesses in this series and just converting it home in both games. I don't know who's more surprised me at the crowd. We just saw a shot there and all the mouths are just open. It's like, what, what even, what did we just witness? I mean, we heard how loud the crowd was. They're yep. stunned. Yep, as am I, Stress, as am I. And wow, Giants, I mean, they played well. It wasn't even like a game where like Fnatic just like, I went, okay, they did fall, fall apart, but like Giants were forcing the issue every single time. They're capitalizing on mistakes. They were making proactive plays themselves. Um.